Hey, what's up, guys? This is Brian from Whisper Status 74. I want to take a minute today to wish each and every one of you a happy Thanksgiving. I hope that you are with friends, you're with family. I hope you guys are taking some time from your very busy schedules and lives to spend some time with your loved ones, both friends and family. Um, and for those of you that aren't or with friends or family, you're away, know you have a friend here with me in the channel and the few thousand subs to the channel. So, Thinking about you guys today, I hope you have an opportunity to relax and to rest. I know some of you are working, those of you in other countries, I'm thinking of you as well. Um, I also want to take a few minutes to talk about buying TVs on Black Friday. And just a couple reminders, as a lot of you have been really waiting for this time, and you're really waiting for the best possible deals, and sometimes in our haste to buy these displays we tend to forget some of the common sense aspects of buying TVs uh, first and foremost please buy from a reputable deal uh, retailer regardless of what country you're in um, eBay uh, Craigslist all those things are fine the challenge though with displays is we all know that they are very fragile they are um, in their best possible shape they're hard to deal with in terms of the panel lottery so please be careful when buying displays. That's outside of Black Friday. We'll do a separate video on you know, um, the different retailers, who to purchase from. Please make sure there's a comprehensive in-store return um, that really protects you guys. As you know from the channel, there are so many different displays, so many different ways for that display to be defective. The panel lottery is no joke. Just read through the comments and you'll see how many people are struggling with panels from all the manufacturers. There is no technology or manufacturer that is immune to the defects of displays. So, number one, make sure you're at a reputable dealer, make sure they have a comprehensive return window and warranty from the manufacturer. Also, if you buy TVs on Black Friday that are at a reduced price, please make sure that they still have the same warranty. Make sure that, you know, it's not this limited warranty open box situation. If you do buy an open box, also make sure that there comes with at least a one-year manufacturer's warranty and a decent warranty from the retailer. As a lot of you guys know, and you'll see it in the comments, once you start dealing with the actual manufacturer, their tolerance for what a war or, or tolerance for what a defect is is very wide. They don't consider dead pixels defects. They don't consider burn-in defects. They just consider that to be part of doing business. So protect yourself. Also, another thing with Black Friday is people tend to just grab the brand name without looking at the particulars of that brand name. Samsung is my favorite example of this because they come out with so many different displays every year. And when you go to places like a Costco, a BJ's, a Sam's Club, you're not really seeing all 2018 models. You're seeing models from last year. You're seeing all kinds of different displays and they're named very similarly. The Q9FN and the QNFN, you know, the Q9F or whatever it was last year, you know, sound very similar. They also have six series, seven series, MU8000. There's just so many and they look very similar. So please, before you walk into that store, do your homework. Find out if that display meets your needs in regards to input lag, refresh rate, resolution. Um, I know a lot of the LGs when they first came out only did 4K at 30. That wouldn't help you for gaming. So look as much as you can online to find out exactly what that the specifics are for each individual HDMI input. Make sure there's enough, enough of them. Some TVs only have a few of them. So just be careful and with the Black Fridays. You're going to see a lot of the lower end models are the ones that are going to be marked down. So just be mindful of them. And again, be careful of the retailer. Be careful of exactly what their return window is. A lot of times Black Friday is a good way to get rid of their inventory, to clear it all out. They definitely don't want that inventory back. So please today, if you go out tonight or go out tomorrow, just jot down some part numbers, some displays that you're looking at. Try to stay in the, the highest to mid-high if you can, just to make sure your, your needs are met. Or really research those, those lower brands thoroughly. 
make sure they have proper HDR implementation. Make sure, like I said before, they have enough HDMI for your needs. And just really protect yourself out there. I know a lot of you guys are looking forward to tomorrow and today. Um, and also, again, just to remind you again, protect yourself when purchasing. Be mindful of where you buy your TVs from and just make sure there's no catches. If you see something that is really down in price substantially, please look into it. Uh, Amazon runs some pretty nice deals for Black Friday as well. So um, try and buy, if you can, from Amazon directly, Prime or A to Z. Try not to deal with a third party simply because returning that display becomes very, very difficult if you have to um, go through a third party. What I mean by that is the third party will rely We'll need to have the display back before they can credit you. Amazon will at least maybe credit you before they return it. There's just different caveats to their process. So a small dealer through Amazon will not be able to give you your money back as quickly as Amazon themselves. They'll also not be able to ship you a new display. So I know I'm saying all negative stuff about being careful in regards to defects. Just watch your back out there. Um, Pay attention, go in there with the part numbers, the details, be prepared, and don't just buy anything, guys, because these things are priced to last you a few years, and I want you to enjoy each and every implement you possibly can. So, thank you again. Happy Thanksgiving to all of you. Go out there, buy your Xbox One X on Black Friday, your PS4 Pro, all your electronics, your headphones, whatever. It's a great time for us electronics fiends to really um, go out there, go shopping. But today, try and be in with your family. Try to be with your friends. Again, if you don't have many, you have me. I'm here. I'm a little behind in the comments, guys. I haven't been feeling well, as you can tell by my great voice. And I just want to tell you that I'm thinking of you uh, during the holidays, during Thanksgiving. Um, you guys are a second family to me and a great community that I'm very, very proud to be part of. And um, just saying that I'm thinking about you guys. Happy Thanksgiving, and I will talk to you soon. Take care.